What's your definition of a drawing? I mean, there are all sorts of things that can propose themselves as drawing, but really it's something that articulates a surface and space, and I think it's something that has a particular relationship to a bare ground. So it's something that's dragged across the surface to make that mark to leave the residue, but there's always something that can test that assumption. I like the Old English word dragan, which is about dragging something across the surface, which is at the root of drawing as much as does in you. So it's between the two. The course starts with an orientation unit where you find the context for your work and the work of the group. Everything I do is an experiment, and I think it should be like that. I know the word is overused, but I think that each time you address yourself to a little bit of paper to try and make a drawing of something, it must be an experiment, otherwise it won't have any life to it. line slowly and you can't draw a slow line quick you have to do them at the right speed um, that is at the, you know one of the important lessons in teaching somebody to draw it's, it's an intellectual process sure but it's also a physical process that is to do with how fast how hard how soft how slow and you are making those movements relative to a lot of intellectual decisions and observed events The second unit of the course is a navigation unit and during that time you'll take part in peer-driven workshops, you will devise a workshop yourself, go on a placement and make other collaborative work that will help you form a research project of your own during the closing stages of the course. The last unit of the course is very much for you to pursue your own research question and through the practice of drawing understand where your drawing might lead you in a professional context and the last exhibition of the year is very much a springboard for your future professional work in the field or to return to the field that you came from with the knowledge that drawing can enhance that work in some way. For me, it started to touch on so many things that were very, very important. It had a very sort of transient but an ephemeral quality to it. You could, you could take your idea and, and realize it anywhere. All you needed were walls. I liked the idea of being able to draw directly on the wall. I liked the idea of the scale of the drawings that you could do by working directly on the wall. I liked the fact that you abandoned paper, that you were doing drawings. It wasn't sort of something that was precious. I liked its primitive qualities, the fact that you were...
drawing is arguably the root of all art and design. Thank <laughs> you.